On February 14, 2023, the Pima Regional Critical Incident Team was activated for a Tucson Police Department officer-involved shooting near North Kolb Road and East 29th Street. Shortly after 1.31 a.m., the Tucson Public Safety Communications Department received a 911 call from a mental health professional who was on the phone with a male who was making statements about ending his own life. The mental health professionals had been on the phone with him for close to 30 minutes before contacting the Tucson Public Safety Communications Department. The male caller advised that he was armed with a firearm and during the call, a mental health professional heard what they believed to be a gunshot. Tucson Police. Hi there, my name is Chris. I'm a count crisis counselor um, from 988 in Alameda County in California. Um, I'm calling because I had a, a three-way call initiated um, by a person from California with their friend who was in Arizona. The friend was reporting thoughts of suicide and having a gun. Um, the call just disconnected and we may believe that we heard a gunshot. We're hoping we can get you in contact to do a wellness check. Officers from Operations Division East were dispatched to a residence in the 6900 block of East Calle Jupiter in an attempt to make contact with the male. While in the area, officers located the male moving around the intersection of North Kolb Road in East Calle Ileo and saw him holding a firearm. A sergeant with advanced training in crisis intervention and hostage negotiations was able to speak with him via cell phone to try to de-escalate the situation. Her communication with him involved multiple phone calls over approximately 15 minutes. The male was asked multiple times to put down the firearm and to stop moving around. He did not follow the repeated commands and while still holding the gun, began moving south through the intersection. Multiple vehicles had driven by the male during this police interaction. The male was moving in the direction of a neighborhood and an officer who was attempting to block traffic when another officer to the west of the male discharged a department issued rifle once, striking the male. Officers immediately rendered first aid using their individual first aid kits until personnel from the Tucson Fire Department arrived. TFD transported the male to a local hospital with non-life-threatening injuries. <laughs> Dude, he needs to stop or we're going to shoot him. He needs to stop or we're going to shoot him. He cannot keep walking away. Okay, he's down. Gun's down. Okay, he's separated from the gun, Sarge. We need to go. Say, are you good, Sarge? Yes, the gun fell. Okay, slow down. I got him. You guys just be ready for hands on. Yes, sir. Do not reach for that gun. Stay there. I got the gun. Got him. The suspect has been identified as 29-year-old Jock London Taylor. Here's a photograph of the firearm that Mr. Taylor was holding. Detectives found this shell casing after the incident. It was forensically matched to the firearm Mr. Taylor was holding and believed to be from a shot he fired while on the phone with the mental health professional.